you know, a year ago, Derek Carr was clearly our, our leader, voted team captain. People don't probably realize Duran was voted our, our you know, second most votes on the captain mm-hmm. vote. He was our defensive captain. Uh, he's a former high school quarterback. I think he relishes that role of, of, of leadership. Uh, he's really done a tremendous job of setting a standard personally. Uh, he's probably the hardest worker on our team. Uh, he holds guys accountable uh, in, in the secondary. Uh, and now he's doing a better job of even you know, holding everybody on the defense accountable. And having that kind of leadership, that kind of you know, experience really helps, you know, because uh, we can't be around those guys all summer. He's out there driving those guys. Is a clear-cut leader right now going into fall? Or? Well, we haven't seen you know Brandon other than on film. Um, so you know, coming out of spring, mm-hmm. Brian Burrell was, was, was clearly the number one guy. Uh, but after spring, and we talked to Brian about this, uh, we, we felt that he still needed to improve. There was things in his game that, that we, we had to get better at. And so we told him, you know, we're not going to name a starter. And at, at that point, we didn't even have Brandon Connett. Uh, and Brian understood that. He's, he's a competitor. Um, and I think bringing Brandon in, you just see those guys in the weight room uh, competing against each other. It's, it's, it's fun. It, that, that competition is going to drive both of them to be better. Well, the, to me, that's, that's the critical deal. It's, it's, you know, we talk to our guys constantly about body language. Uh, everything they project has to be you've got confidence, you know, Adversity is going to happen, but it's got to it's got to wash off you like water off a duck. It's got to be part of the game. Hey, I know I'm not going to make the perfect play, the perfect throw every time, uh, and when I don't, it's it's no big deal. It's part of it. I learn from it and I move on. And uh, uh, I think Brian got uh, you know uh, a lot better at that in in the spring. And again, Brandon Kanetz played four years of college football. He's played against some you know uh, very good college football teams. He, he started games in, in some very very difficult places and, and had a lot of success so I don't think he's going to be phased by uh, how big some of the stadiums are or how big some of the opponents are and I think just having that experience and then having Brian not as much experience but seeing seeing that uh, you know composure that, that Brandon has both those guys are in big six bowl games you know I, I think very well um, if you look at the history of our league uh, the Mountain West champion I think uh, Craig Thompson was talking about this you know about 75% of the time would have been the highest ranked team out of the out of non five. So, you know, I, I think our access to those bowls is is uh, tremendously improved. Um, I think we've got a deeper conference than we've had in a long time. So that's going to be you know difficult to, to go through undefeated. Um, but you know, if somebody were to you know have a special season and win the Mountain West, I think I think they're going to be right there in the mix. You know, our league, the AAC. As I look at it, you know, are going to probably have the two best opportunities. Do you prefer the way this is set up as opposed to the way the BCS was set up? I think it's a good compromise. I think we have more access to those host bowls, the former BCS bowls, uh, adding two of them, the Cotton Bowl, which which I've you know, been fortunate enough to coach in, is a great bowl, uh, and, and, and the Peach Bowl. Uh, to have an automatic berth in, in one of those for one of our group of five, I think I think is huge. Um, uh, it's a little disappointing, you know, with the uh, college football playoff only having four positions because I, I think it's going to be very difficult uh, for any non-Power 5 team to, to get in there. But it was very, very difficult. You know, we never got in the national championship game either. Uh, so it's arguable, you know, whether or not you have more access or less access on that 